Here's a quick tip for measuring the distance between your bolt holes on your turbo mount. This is a trick that, um, that works out really well and oftentimes we ask people for the distance between the bolt holes on a turbo drain. And oftentimes people take their tape measure, you know, they'll say, okay, yeah, it's about two and a sixteenth, two and inches. Well, when you have a machine hole that has a little chamfer and threads, it's really hard with a tape measure to tell if it really is, you know, plus or minus a sixteenth. You could kind of justify that either way. So to get a more accurate measurement, um, here's a trick if you have a pair of digital calipers. Thread in, bolts, and if you have Preferably something with a round head. If it's, if it's hex, you can do it. You just got to make sure you line up the flats in the way that this works. So to measure the, the distance, you're going to measure, you know, halfway in from outside to outside. You, you can't just measure outside to outside and get a correct number. And you can kind of do this and get the right number. But um, we know that you come in the radius from the outside. So halfway is a radius. Halfway is a radius gets you the center. Well, that happens to be one diameter. So if you simply take your calipers and zero them out on one head and then measure that outside to outside. It's going to subtract one diameter and that's going to give you right there, right at about two inches. It's not two and a sixteenth. It's not an uh, inch and a half, but it's pretty, pretty dang close there, right at two inches. So that gives you a lot easier way to measure with accuracy and pretty much anybody has a cheap pair of digital calipers that'll work just fine. It's not, doesn't need to be that accurate, but it's, uh, it, uh, it definitely gives you a good idea of what it is. Hope that helps.